Hello everybody, this is Zelda Maniac1994 and welcome back to the Bad Racing Game series. Today, we'll be playing, uh... Um... I already forgot what the game is called. <laughs> uh... Okay. Look at that beautiful image. Um, called Coffin Dodgers. Oh, it was right there. Okay, so... <laughs> this game came out for the Switch just recently here and, um... Uh, it, get, it got some mediocre to okay reviews. Mediocre. I just realized mediocre and okay mean the same thing, but, you know, who, uh, actually cares. Okay, so, we're gonna do, um, we're just gonna do, uh, oh, what do I wanna do? Uh, I don't wanna do story mode. Let's just do, um, just open world. You know what, let's just... We'll do a, quick, a few quick races and we'll see how this goes. So pick a soul. So we got Jeremiah, the Hawk, Brenneman, or Hank, Martha, Wilbur, Lucy, Rudolph, and Percival. And death is locked. Um, yeah, let's let's just play as Jeremiah. <laughs> so the premise of the game is in this town full of old people, uh, the Grim Reaper moves in. And essentially, these people have to race in order to keep their lives. And the people who come in last place get their lives taken uh, by the Grim Reaper. Wow, this game looks beautiful, doesn't it? Okay, so... Uh oh Oh boy, this is really jittery. Every time I... I oh boy, wrong way. Okay, let's go back. Ah! Yeah, every time I move, it kind of jitters a little bit. Um, ZR goes, hey look, we have items, just like Mario cares. And my item's gone, what happened to my item? What, what in the world? Okay, so holding down B does what? It swings my cane at people? Um, let's see, okay. Oh boy. Oh, this is a... Okay, that's a turbo. This game looks kind of empty though, doesn't it? Oh boy. We got four laps in a race. I think this game kind of looks like it should belong on like a, a PS2 or something. Like, I mean, it has an HD coat of paint, but that's about it. It doesn't look very high definition though. Like, the models and textures are just kind of bland. Uh, not in the way that, um... Oh, goodness, what was that one game? I can't remember what it was played. That, uh, that Hot Wheels game I played, where it looked very much like a downgraded, like, PS... What was it? PS1 or PS2 that I compared it to? I can't remember this point because it was so trash. But, uh, yeah. This was like the kind of quality game you'd find on a PS2. What in the world? Holding down... The right joystick turns the camera backwards. I can't get over how jittery this is. Oh boy. There's something special about this game. Uh. Okay, so it looks like the, the uh, cane whacking feature is kind of not really existent. Like, it's there, but it doesn't seem to work. Oh, wait. Oh, it makes him dizzy. Okay. But it's... Ah, uh, this is terrible. We're all just riding on little scooters. Oh, boy. Is this game even competitive? I will say I'm having fun, but only in the, uh, ironic sense of this game is just so... Horrible looking and uh, controls kind of <sighs> not really bad, but just like the visuals itself and the fact when you move, you just kind of jitter. Uh, that's kind of ugh. All right, I got third! Yay! Good for you, Jeremiah. Oh boy, that's great. I hate old people. Okay. Cool. But that... I don't know. Alright. So, uh... 
Just change character, I guess. Uh. Alright, let's play as on Percival. I guess. Maybe. Can we swap courses? The town's locked, the farm, the graveyard, the showdown. Okay. Let's go to race two. Eh. It didn't seem to do anything from what I did. That melee attack. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, this game's a mess. Uh. Oh boy, that's a turn. Okay. I wonder if this would be any fun with, like, two or more people. It's hard to imagine this game being fun at all. But maybe it has just enough, like, high jinx power. Okay, just knock the person off the scooter. Cool. And you. Can, can I get first, maybe? If I try to play this competently, it's hard to say, but I could. Maybe. It'd be good if I got first in one of these bad racing games. I mean, I did in one of them, but... Okay, whoa, hey, the turning's not bad. At least for this. So, um, yeah. The game's kind of desolate. For some reason, like, these environments kind of remind me of a Cartoon Network game. I don't know, like, it just has that kind of feel, I guess. Especially going in here in the, uh, sewers. I don't know, it just kind of reminds me of one. Not, like, one in particular, just, like, the general art style that some of those games have taken. Wait, what happened? Why'd I spin out of control? And why is my item gone? Did I not hold on to my items for very long? Okay, I have a shield barrier thing. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm kind of curious as to what the uh, exploration whatever it is or the um, open world mode is. Like what it would be like. I mean, because this game looks it, it's just kind of I don't know, not, not unfinished, but definitely not at the uh, requirements that a uh, like current generation uh, game should be at. Like, I mean, this is out on the Switch. And, like, you know, like the Switch and the PS3, Xbox 360, PS4, and Xbox One. Even the Wii U, like, you should have games that look and feel better than this. But, um, no, nah, apparently, let's just put our average mediocre games on current consoles. I mean, I wouldn't say they wouldn't sell. I mean, I bought it. But, um, yeah, not really saying all that much, though. Considering I got this just for a video, and chances are I'm not going to be playing this anymore after that. Um, but who knows, maybe I can find someone to play with. I was kind of hoping I can go like a whole, along the whole wall there, but I don't have enough speed to keep that going. Where, are you, where is even my competition at? Do I even have any? Why do I not have a horn to go Hong Kong with? Is this over? Yes, it is over. Alright. So, um... You win! Oh, that that's great. <laughs> oh, great. You win. Uh, yeah, I think that's <laughs> gonna cover it for this episode. I can't really think of too much more to do, and I don't want to do the story mode or anything. So, we're just gonna leave it at that. Anyways, guys, thank you all so very much for watching. This is Zelda Maniac 1994 signing out.